<laughs> that was almost too easy. Congratulations on taking over the U.S. healthcare system, Doctor. All it took was a little elbow grease and a comically large space laser. So what's your plan now? I'll do what I do best. I'm going to make it evil. I'll start by squeezing cash out of the chronically sick by charging exorbitant prices for their medicine. Diabetics will have to pay me a hundred, no, two hundred dollars for their insulin. <laughs> they already do that. What? Insulin already costs at least that much. Really? Two hundred dollars? It's closer to three hundred. Wow, okay. Diabolical. Yes, the U.S. beat me to the punch there. They certainly beat you to punching diabetics. It's fine. I have plenty of other great, evil ideas. Next, I'll make treatment impossible to access by ensuring the hospitals are understaffed. And I'll do this by limiting the number of people who are even allowed to become doctors. Woo! <laughs> they do that too. <laughs> what? No, there's no way. Do you remember having to do a residency to become a doctor? Well, I'm not a medical doctor exactly. I have a PhD in women's studies. Women's studies? Being an evil dictator doesn't exclude me from being a feminist shadow. Right. Well, you have to complete a residency at a hospital to become a physician. But the funds for hiring residents are provided by the U.S. government. So the number of available residency programs, thus doctors, is decided by Congress's budget. So not only did they already do my evil thing, they did it in a more sinister and subtle way. Basically, I'm not sure if I should be proud of my country or disgusted by it. Maybe both. Seems as though I'll have to do something truly despicable to defeat the US government. In that case, I'll make sure that the only people who can even afford healthcare are the ones who work for companies that benefit my economic interests. That's called insurance. Uh, and I'll let the hospitals deny treatment entirely to those who don't have the correct insurance. No. Yup. Oh my god. You have some tough competition. They've already done every evil thing. Next you're going to tell me the hospitals are just straight up racist. Funny you should say that. According to recent research- Stop! I don't want to know! Ugh, all this information is making me feel like I'm gonna have a heart attack. Should I call an ambulance? No, it'll cost too much. Screw this. I can't be more cartoonishly evil than the United States healthcare system. And I am literally a cartoon villain. So what will you do? I'm just going to take over something pure and free of corruption. Like, um, the U.S. educational system. Oh boy. 